Hello, this is Christopher Kennedy and welcome to Learn Logic Pro 10 in two hours. Logic Pro is an amazing piece of software that enables you to create music more easily than ever before. But when you first look at it, it can seem incredibly daunting. There are so many settings and variables and when you look at a completed setup and mixed tracks, it just looks so complicated you wonder how you could ever learn your way around it. The great news is that it's actually quite intuitive and I can show you the best way to dive right in there and get using it. The problem for a lot of users is that they've perhaps used GarageBand or another digital audio workstation and so the temptation is to come in and just try things out. And the danger is that it can be so overwhelming and there are so many little intricacies that you don't really learn what you're doing. The other thing that can happen is that you get the manual out and you study the theory and you read everything and it takes weeks and that can actually be very dull. So the best way to deal with this is just to dive straight in and make something. In the very first lesson I'm going to show you how to assemble a dance music track from just a few loops and audio effects that are included. And this isn't just a case of pasting other people's work together. You get to adapt it so that it's your own music. You change rhythms, you modify sounds, and you create something that you can use as the basis for your own work. But the purpose of that lesson really is to show you how the various controls work and how you get around logic. And then once you know that, we'll move into looking at all the other aspects of logic, such as creating rhythms with drummer, which is an automated and intuitive way of creating and modifying drum tracks in different styles. Then we'll look at the various ways to create and control MIDI events so that you can control synthesizers and simulated instruments. When we look at recording audio, we'll see the best practices for recording audio and how you can take tracks and adjust their pitch so that if somebody's singing out of key, you can adjust that. Or if you just prefer a different note in the performance, you can shift that note quite easily. Once we've edited audio, we'll look at mixing and mastering so that your work actually gets out into the world. Because that, after all, is the purpose of Logic Pro. You can create and complete music all in one application. It is a complex piece of software, but if you have any musical ability at all, you will find that it comes to you quite naturally. And in just a couple of hours, you'll feel confident to dive into your own projects.